Thanks for tuning in to WSKI TV 17. Looks like a great morning out there on the hill. This is brought to you by Geppetto's. You can find them in Village West, and they've got their two for Tuesday, two for $30 happening right up at the place to be any time, day or night. Well, for today, looks like we'll see some mild temperatures out there, 27 to 31 up at the summit, 37 to 41 down here on the base. We'll see a west-southwest wind, 20 to 35 miles an hour up towards the summit, so that will be noticeable. Uh, southwest down here, 10 to 16, gusting to 20 down around the base with partly sunny skies. Guys, so get out there and enjoy the excellent uh, skiing and riding out there on the hill or just any outdoor activity here in the main High Peaks region. Partly sunny skies with a chance of a flurry for Wednesday. We'll see some gusty winds, especially up top on the mountain on the day of Wednesday. And we'll also see temperatures falling throughout the day after a high of 39 degrees down here around the base. Looking ahead at your extended forecast, mostly sunny skies for the day on Thursday, a high of 24 degrees, a low of 7 Partly sunny skies for Friday as well with a high of 32 uh, down here on the base and a low up, to, up at the summit of 16. And then looks like Saturday night into Sunday we could see some more snow. So that is some uh, great news out there. Birchwood Interiors, they've got the lowest prices on Serta mattresses in the nation, so take advantage of that. They're right in Village West. They're open year-round. They're also online at birchwoodinteriors.com. They bring you this trail report. We've got 50 groomed trails out there, 145 trails open, about uh, nine lifts getting into those runs and some great packed powder conditions out there. Central Mountain Trails that they got to last night uh, out there grooming. Timberline, Tote Road, King's Landing, Hayburner, Lower Comp Hill, White Nitro from the top. That should be in great shape. Uh, Wedge, Gandhi Line, Sluice, Narrow Gauge, Candy Side, Lower Winter's Way, as well as Boardwalk and the landing. Over on the east side of the mountain, they plan to get out on Hallback, Widowmaker, Ramdown, Wiffletree, Two Hall, Rollway, and Slasher. And on the west side of the mountain, they plan to get Scoot, Lower Horseshoe and Good Chance, and all the terrain parks got smoothed out as well. Sidewinder, that's the border cross course. Skybound is the beginner park. Haywire, the advanced park. And Stomping Grounds is the medium-sized park out there. If you're into that, go check that out. The Stomping Grounds also starts with the mini pipe, so it's always a good time in there. Snubber, Skidway, and Sawduster will get going at 8.30. Those are the lifts that move you around the base area. Double Runner East will get going at 8.30. That gets you a little higher on the hill for some nice beginner runs down Boardwalk. It's a nice um, wide slope as well as Lower Winter's Way. Super Quad and Skyline get going at 8.30. They get you to a variety of mid-mountain terrain. Timberline, that's the lift that gets you up to the top of the mountain. If you're a beginner, take the Timberline uh, trail down. And if you're an expert, check out uh, Gandhi Line from the top or White Nitro off the front face. Wiffle Tree and King Pine, those lifts service the east sides of the mountain. Wiffle Tree, a more intermediate area. King Pine gets you to some great expert terrain, and they get going at 9 o'clock this morning. 20K of snowshoeing down at the Sugar Love Outdoor Center. The ice rink is open all day. They've got pickup hockey going on tonight from 5 to 8 p.m. They've got over 70K of packed powder conditions down there for classic and skate-style skiing, as well as some great eats at the Boo Moose Bakery and Cafe. The conditions out on the snowmobile trails are just about perfect, so get out there and enjoy. See some great views out there some wildlife as well it's a great uh, way to see the main high peaks region from a different point of view also if you're looking for something else to do main huts and trails they've got trailheads all around uh, the valley for the poplar stream hut as well as the flagstaff hut or the stratton brook hut excuse me and those are a great place to go in uh, and have lunch or a drink or two and then head back down great alternative to stuff going on on the hill also we want to let you know to check out our website at wskitv.com